Hi everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Buffer for social media. If you want to stop wasting time jumping between Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, or Twitter every time you want to post, then in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Buffer to manage all of your social media in just one place. By the end of this video tutorial, you will know how to sign up for Buffer, connect your accounts, schedule your posts, track performance, and more. So if you would like to follow along step by step, go ahead and navigate to the link in the description down below. And without much further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So if you are unfamiliar, Buffer is a social media management tool that lets you schedule posts ahead of time across multiple channels, analyze how your content performs, engage with comments and messages all in one unified inbox, and create a simple link in bio landing page for your profiles. So for a small business juggling Instagram stories, Facebook posts, and LinkedIn updates, Buffer can cut down the app hopping by 90%. Instead of manually opening each platform, you can create all of your content in Buffer's publishing calendar and then automatically publish it at the time that you choose. You can go on vacation, spend time with your family or focus on your core business and Buffer covers your posting schedule for you. So to get started, all you have to do is navigate to the link in the description for convenience, click on it and then sign up for your own free account. Once you have logged in, you will land on this dashboard right here and then on the left menu, you want to click on add channels and then connect a new channel. After that, you can connect your own pages such as Facebook page, Instagram business, LinkedIn company page, and so many different channels. For example, for Facebook, you just click on it and then click Facebook and then connect. Authorize Buffer to access your pages and then pick the page that you want to post on and then click add to Buffer. Same thing for Instagram or LinkedIn. You want to repeat the same process for any other networks that you want, such as Twitter, Pinterest, etc. And then once connected, you will see them listed under the publishing and then all channels. Next up, let's go ahead and see how you can schedule a post. Click on publishing at the top and then select calendar. After that, you can pick a time slot so you can switch to week view for granularity and then click on Thursday at 1 p.m. for example or any slot that you choose. Create your post so at the top you can select which channels to post to and check if you don't want to. And then write your caption in the text box and click the emoji icon to add any fun icons that you want. After that, you can upload a photo or a video to add the images or in the medium, or you can import them from Dropbox or Canva. Set a date and time for your posting. Now buffer defaults to your chosen slot, but you can edit that if needed. And then you can customize per network, so you can click on customize for each network. For Instagram, you might remove any long URLs since they are not clickable. And then for Twitter, watch the character limit and trim your text if necessary. You can of course add the hashtags and the notes by clicking on hashtags and then you create a group. You can name it something whatever you would like and add up to 10 hashtags. Insert the group into your Instagram or Twitter posts. And on Instagram, you can also add a first comment with extra tags. If you added an Instagram account, you can also go to the settings and then you can tag a physical location or add a link to your shop grid. Click schedule post once you're done and you should be set. Your new post appears on the calendar in a colored block at your chosen time. You can easily hover to edit or drag to a new slot. Now, once your posts go live and you have some data, you can head to the analytics in the top menu. On the overview, you can see the total clicks, likes, and shares across all of your channels. And then you can check the channel stats as you can choose Facebook or Instagram, etc. to dive deeper, view the engagement rate, link clicks, and the audience growth. You can also discover which posts drove the most interaction so you can double down on that content. For example, if you post a video on Instagram and it gets a bunch of shares or a 10% engagement rate, then you can plan more of that video content. If your LinkedIn job related post underperforms, you can adjust your audience targeting or the posting times. And with these insights, you will keep refining your strategy week after week and growing your business. Also, under the engagement tab, Buffer collects all of the comments and mentions from your connected channels. So you want to select a channel, for example, Facebook comments, and then you will see the unanswered and all of the comments tabs. Click on comment to reply in the application without having to log into Facebook app, and then Buffer posts your reply directly under the comments. This keeps every brand interaction all in one place, so you never miss any questions or complaints, especially crucial for small teams. We also have Buffer Starter Page Tool, which is a simple link in bio landing page, and here is how you can set it up. You want to navigate to the starter page in the top menu and then choose a create page and then give it a name, something like your brand. And then on the right, you will see blocks for profile image, links, social icons, and custom buttons. You want to upload your logo and then edit each link to point to your website, shop, or upcoming webinar or Instagram. 
and then add a YouTube or events block if you host live streams or webinars. Under appearance, pick a background color and font and then click publish page. You will get a shareable URL, which is perfect for your Instagram bio or email signature to drive traffic to all of your important online destinations. Now, when it comes to team members, collaboration is key for growing brands. So under the settings and then the team, you can invite any coworkers that you have. So click invite teammates and then enter their email and assign a role such as admin, which gives them full access, contributor, which can draft and schedule posts, and then a viewer as they can only read the analytics. Once they accept the invite, teammates can log in and then start scheduling, replying and reviewing analytics with no password sharing required. Buffer also offers mobile applications for iOS and Android. You want to search for Buffer in the App Store or Google Play as the mobile application lets you quickly draft and queue Instagram stories, post or schedule on the go and approve team drafts with a swipe. Under applications and integrations, you want to connect tools like Canva, so the design inside of Buffer, Zapier to automate sharing new blog posts, or Google Analytics to see traffic in one dashboard. These integrations supercharge your workflow. So that will be a wrap on our complete Buffer tutorial and walkthrough. Thanks so much for watching. We've covered the setup, basic scheduling, analytics, engagement, etc. Everything that you need to get started with Buffer as a social management tool. If you are ready to save hours each week and grow your audience organically, then head over to to buffer.com use the link in the description for convenience and then sign up for a free account and explore the essential trial if this video has helped you go ahead and give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos similar to this one